Let's do this. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nick G, the host, and today I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying? And with the goddamn hair your league. Now, I told y'all I would like to hear a man's point of view on what Chris is doing. <laughs> At this point, I ain't gonna lie, it's funny. He did do a video with Baby CJ. Um, do I want to react to the whole video? I do not. Uh, will I? Not sure. If I do, it's not gonna be on this channel. So look out for it on another channel. All right. Um, in the mean in between, let's get it to McQueen talking about Chris Joe. Better than, you know what I'm saying, John Cena. Uh -oh. I think he's better than, you know, the Undertaker. I think he's better than any masculine man you can think of on the planet. Yeah. Right? Now, they already played the video of him saying the same shit he's been saying that we've reacted to a hundred times. I don't want to hear it again. <laughs> now, with all that being said, you know, I will say this. Chris, you also have to be the most retarded nigga I've ever come across. Mm. And what I mean by that is, like, how are you going to say that, oh, yeah, uh, you know, that don't mean he cheated. But in the same breath, say, well, you know, he's not being faithful. Let's be real. Let's be 100. He not, he not, he not. Being <laughs> nigga, aren't you the one that cheated? Aren't you the, the leader of the cheating niggas association? <laughs> are you talking about somebody else cheating? <laughs> nigga, you're in the position you're in right now looking dusty because you cheated. <laughs> I, <laughs> I wanted to know what these niggas was thinking. Oh my God, McQueen is already crazy. But that was funny. I've been laughing at all these niggas. I mean, even Chris has made me laugh these past few days. <laughs> you had it all, my brother. He did. The goat. You had it all, but you fucked it up. Because you want to go stick your dick in some bitches from L.A. that was not the right bitches to be fucking. Ain't that some shit, D? My thing is, why are you so, like, get over her. She gone. Stop worrying about her. She don't want you back. Now what he trying to do, he trying to sabotage <laughs> anything he could do to talk about this dick and that girl. <laughs> he trying to sabotage, bro, the entire time. And he got to understand. Sorry, y'all need some chips. <laughs> he got to understand he's, he's not sabotaging anything. Out of all the conversations I've had this week with all this shit going on, a lot of women won't leave a nigga if he's cheap. And you know what's unfortunate? This wasn't the same conversation five years ago. But that's the problem. Chris late. He's always late. <laughs> it's late. The conversation of cheating today is a different conversation from five years ago. I've also learned that as well. Once again, not only did he cheat, he, he just threw it all in her face. Clarence didn't. And amongst a lot of other things. And that's why people are treating this the way they treating it. And everybody just think everybody's in love with Clarence. And that's just not how that works. <laughs> <laughs> that's not it my nigga you late we are in a society now let me show y'all something because somebody sent this to me yesterday and i'm like right on the money y'all know justin laboy justin what is it justin la boy or whatever the fuck so y'all know he's the king of posting shit right boom the post somebody sent me yesterday, unless he did not post it yesterday. But well, somebody sent me this yesterday, and of course, I don't know where it's at. Come ass girl. Everybody hate Gemini. I trust you. I, I put it on my story. Hold on. My story. All right. <clears throat> Open discussion. Are you going to dump every person partner that cheats on you? Right? Because that's the topic of the conversation now. It's like, all right, one nigga cheated on Queen. She left him, right? Well, she left him after he uh, cheated multiple times and was throwing it in her fucking face. I think before that he cheated, she didn't, she didn't do nothing. Anyway, 
So everybody would say all men cheat. I say that. I think all men cheat. No cap. If they get put in a situation where they have to, and when I say have to, when I told y'all, like, if Clarence walking on the yacht, a woman grab his dick, that's one woman. Another woman grab his dick. Ain't no cameras around, child. You don't know what the fuck these niggas is going through. Once again, if Chris was going through the same shit five years ago, I completely understand Chris now as well. And I wish... That didn't happen to Chris the way it did. He made it worse for himself. But five years ago, I think Chris was getting tested just as much as Clarence would have been tested on that fucking yacht, which I think we none of us considered. And I will say that none of us consider that. I didn't consider that. Like, damn, Chris is this young man who out here getting all this fucking money around all these women. That nigga got lost in the sauce. Let's just talk about it. He got lost in the sauce. And unfortunately, now I understand that. But with Clarence, it's also a different situation because nobody has no, nobody has no proof. The nigga ain't come out and say shit. He ain't rubbing it in her face or, you know what I'm saying? All the shit that Chris did, (laughs) him and Clarence are still two different dudes, unfortunately. So, um, I already told y'all, you know, in a situation with me and my shorty, I don't think cheating is accidents. I think you wanted to indulge in some more chocolate. I think you wanted to indulge in different ice cream. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I don't think cheating is a mistake. You don't just fall in some pussy. I think that that's cap. When I want a different flavor, it need to be discussed. All right, now I'm feeling like I want some different ice cream, baby. What's up? You trying to go get this ice cream with me? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And for me, it'll only be because there's something going on in my relationship that's lacking. <clears throat> when I'm lacking something in a relationship, I am not, I am not the best person because I just, I feel like I give everything to my partner. I would like everything. I would like to receive everything. You know what I'm saying? On that other end. But anyway, uh, I can't see the answers. Well, most people said that they would leave. I call Cap. But anyway, finish. He's, he, he cannot, he cannot, you know what I'm saying? Can, he, make sure you guys put the uh, bills. Keep, yeah, make sure you put all the comments on the screen. Everybody laughing, man. I want everybody to feel engaged. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. You know, like I said, you know, it's 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 crazy because Chris, listen to me, brother. Like, I, I, I know that. I think it said, this is what happens when you lose a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to me. I know that at the end of the day, Chris, you, you know, uh, right now, brother, what's going on with you? Hey, even though that I admire you and I love you so, and I still agree that every man on this planet should be modeling their game, their money, their life after you. You are still broke and lonely right now. You're broke. Let's be 100. Let's be absolutely oh, 1,000. Shit. Right now, you're broke. You're lonely. You miss fucking queen. You know what I'm saying? No disrespect to Queen at all. No disrespect to Clarence either. You know what I'm saying? But you miss fucking her. You miss that good, nice coaching. You miss. Oh my God. McQueen always go too far. <laughs> brother. Okay. Right now, yeah, the kid buy her, you know? And then immediately she went straight to New York, got a light skinned nigga, and had a baby with that nigga too. That shit fucking, that shit sent you into the shower. That shit killed that nigga. That shit killed that nigga. That's, that's, that's a fact. That, that shit, that's now, a now, fact. He, now she getting blown out by a nigga with a New York accent, light skinned nigga. Can't have baby. <laughs> this nigga McQueen is you terrible. If I was Clarence, I would make a drill need. Nick DDG chat report Chris YouTube last night. What that mean? New York song version of It's Supposed to Be Me. Uh-huh. I would make that. And make you know that saying? shit just go yeah, of stupid course. viral. That would be my response to what Chris just said on that video. What is chat report? You know what I'm saying? But see, I understand Clarence. You know what I'm saying? He's not a comedian. He's not a retard like me. You know what I'm saying? You can't do that because call, obviously, you know what I'm saying? The bitch is going to be mad at you. I get it. You know, from a... Send me the link or whatever you're talking about. I don't know what chat report means. Play to play, I can understand. You know? But let me tell y'all this, Aqua Force. Okay? Make sure... Hold on. If you don't mind Queen stand with Claire if he cheated... Then cool, that's your opinion, and it is her life, so I don't care either. 
I agree. Even if he did, he wasn't throwing it in her face. Yeah. They reported his YouTube page. What? Where's that at? Send me the link. Sure. I would never. I don't understand. That even though I say that this man is the most, you know what I'm saying, admirable, you know what I'm saying, man on the planet, the most, just a, an amazing, a hell of a man, you know? Do not ever, ever, ever put yourself in the position where he is right now. Because I can tell you right now, we can all tell from the way he's dressed, the way he's acting, the way he cannot keep Queen Nigel's name out of his mouth, that this nigga is broke and lonely. You know what I'm saying? He is at rock bottom right now. You know what I'm saying? Do not be like this nigga, okay? Matter of fact, don't be like me because I'm trying to be like this nigga. Uh, this, <laughs> this nigga, nigga be trolling. <laughs> no, I'm Word. saying don't be like me because I'm trying I'm trying to be like this nigga. All right, don't we look on his stream on Twitch. Don't be like me. Because, I, like I said, I think Chris, Chris is the GOAT. But like I said, do not be like him. Don't, no, don't be like me, you know? Because it, you're going to just end up lonely talking about it. Someone, I can't believe it. I would never in my life be talking about another nigga for this fucking long. Come on now. Don't they got two kids now? They got two kids Let now. it go, brother. They got two kids. No, got she one. is gone, nigga. Gone forever. She is gone. Singing in that nigga ear while <laughs> busting her down. Word. Singing in that nigga <laughs> ear. <laughs> This nigga fucking McQueen, bro. He has always been a wild card, but my nigga, he ain't wrong on this one. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Man, while you at the house, talking, about, it's supposed to be me. Oh. It was supposed to be. It was. It's not. But no you more. fucked it up. Bro. It's gone. <laughs> it's gone. My <laughs> thing is, he is upset. He got caught. That, For sure. Hello. That was my whole point. The nigga mad. He got caught. And and um. Clarence, not Clarence fans, Chris fans are on Chris' side like, yo, Queen, do him just like you did Chris. Y'all don't see this as two different situations? And it's annoying because I'm not biased, in, bro. I don't give a fuck what y'all say. When Chris fucking cheated on Queen, I told y'all. Nigga, they young. Niggas cheat. That shit happens, girl. Whatever. But the fact that he just throwing this shit all in her face is so disrespectful, bro. It was so disrespectful. And at this point, fuck it. If you think I'm biased, like you said, pretty, uh, uh, pretty, what is your name, friend? Pretty ass, my. We just biased then, friend, because. This is two different situations, bro. Two total different situations. He upset he got caught. 100%. Of course. I feel like Clarence is cheating on that girl. No. <laughs> Come on now. I know. He probably busting bitches down left and right. Wait, he's a, he, <laughs> but he ain't getting caught. He's not getting caught. I will. I don't know if he's actually I, I don't know. I don't know. Is. But I will say this. You know what I'm saying? It is a possibility. It is. It, it is. is, a, it is, is a Clarence, Clarence is the homie. Okay. I fuck with you, Clarence. I'm not, I am not saying that you were cheating. But. Come on now. At the end of the day, you are rich, nigga. At the end of the day, you are Alaskan, nigga. At the end of the day, you do have a lot of access to a lot of pussy. So, Chris might not be wrong, but he's also wrong because of the fact that there is no proof. There's no proof. So, thank you. I, I'm saying the same shit. <laughs> like I said, make sure y'all don't be like me because I'm trying to be like Chris Hills to go. You know? This nigga is fucking trolling. Y'all. If you ask me, especially just on some, on some, like, random shit, I don't think Clarence is cheating. But this yacht situation, I will say, without proof, because I don't know if it's proof, oh, obviously, this girl asking for 15K for whatever proof she got. Um, these girls already knew Chris. It's a lot of like, I don't like that. You know, it's a lot of weird shit going on with it. But I will say, if that nigga was on the yacht and all them thirsty ass hoes was on there trying to suck some dick, I wouldn't be surprised if he did the shit. Period. I wouldn't be surprised if he did it. I swear to God, I wouldn't be. <laughs> That's the best I can say because, I mean, bro. I wouldn't go on the yacht because I know I would bust some shit down. I'm telling y'all. I told my woman. She said the same thing, though. 
Like, baby, can you imagine being on a yacht like that? Like, you know what I'm saying? With a bunch of bitches who just ready to put something in their mouth. That's just kind of how that go. And you rich? Whatever. Y'all, ain't no different from all these other niggas who be cheating per se. And that nigga Clarence was a dog before he got with Queen. But one thing that he is good at, if this is true, there ain't no proof circulate around this motherfucker. No proof. None. No proof has hit the surface yet. Okay? The day the proof hit the surface, I'm going to be like, God damn, my boy, you caught. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Your ass is fucking caught. But as of today, no proof? Nothing but a bitch just saying what happened? <laughs> I'm not going that shit. Y'all let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Um, I know damn well if I was on one of them yachts, boy, I'm going to be in a sticky situation. Sticky, sticky, sticky. Alcohol getting touched on by a bunch of bad bitches. Who, and I, I'm going to just say if I was on a lesbian boat, per se, not a straight one, a lesbian one. But even these bitches that be on lesbian, I mean, on straight boats, they love eating some pussy. That's just what these bitches do. Love something in their mouth, okay? So, I'm telling you right now, I will be in some shit. That's why I won't be getting on the boat. <laughs> don't yacht me. I'm straight. I don't want to get on the yacht. I'm going to bust something down for a fact. So, no, I'm cool on the yacht. <laughs> cool on the yacht. Niggas just got to be honest. That's that's the difference, too, with, with Chris in this situation. Bro, this is five years later. We, we still entering into a whole new world every day. You see some random ass shit that just changed the world every day. We are not in those times anymore. Plus, it's in the... Oh, come on, Kia! You on a yacht in the ocean! Drunk as fuck! Around a bunch of rich niggas for 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 y'all, <laughs> but if it would, I would be one of the rich niggas in that situation if I was on a lesbian boat. And what I keep trying to say, because nine times out of ten, if I'm on a straight boat, <laughs> you know, life is different with me. If I'm on a straight boat and everybody just sucking dick and and uh, you know what I'm saying, I would be one to be watching. Do you hear me? Oh, yes. Oh my God, yes. Oh, my niggas is getting they, you know what I'm saying? Getting they meat with. I am all here for it, okay? But a lesbian boat? Ain't gonna be no talking, nigga. <laughs> I won't be, yes, yes, yes. You know what I'm saying? Listen, I, me, no boat. TT, no boat. We can't get on no boat. We already know how that's gonna work, okay? I won't be eating no coochie. But I'm just saying. But I'm just saying that's the type of honesty you got to have in 2023, y'all. You know how niggas used to be like, hell no, I would never look at another woman. Nigga, I would never like cheat on my girl. I would never. Conversations are different these days. They are. <laughs> let's, let's talk about it for real. The queen don't care if he got ass. I don't care. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> she cared about Chris. That was the difference. <laughs> Did he let queen know if you need me, I'm here. Oh, shit. Oh, but at this point, Clarence never responded. Yeah, he probably won't. Well, he got to go live. So the day he go live, that's when he'll speak about it. But that's when he going to decide when he want to speak about it. And I'm going to be here for it. Can't wait. You can't never say if you ain't never been. That's my whole point. Niggas be lying. My homeboy. I wish he was. Let me call this nigga. See where he at. Because y'all. That nigga. He has a boat. He lives in Miami. He has his own boat. I need him to pull up. Where you at? Yep. Damn, all right, all right. I'll still be live. All right, bye. <clears throat>
he has a boat, right? And uh, he like, nigga, when you outside on that water, anything goes. He said he tell people, hey, like Boosie. Boosie, for example, y'all, Boosie said the other day, I'm going to react to it. He said the other day on Ball Alert, he said, listen, if you come to my party, don't be married because I'm going to get your dick sucked. He said this shit the other day. I'm about to react to it right now. But anyway, y'all let me know what you think down in the comment section below. We done with this video. Um, McQueen crazy as hell. Bye, y'all.